Dieu va arriver. Now, let us see. Fourth question. Fill in the blanks to make the following statements true. I have two questions here. Let us see the first one. I have minus 5 plus minus 8 is equal to minus 8 plus dash. That is, we need to write the missing integer here. Now, let us assume this missing integer as x. Now, if you see, let us write minus 5 plus minus 8 is equal to minus 8 plus I assumed this missing integer as x. I have written minus 5 plus minus 8 is equal to minus 8 plus assumed this missing integer as x. Now let us solve on the left hand side. I have Minus 5 plus into minus minus 8 is equal to minus 8 plus x. I have written minus 5 plus into minus minus 8 is equal to minus 8 plus x. Now let us solve these two numbers. We have Two minus signs that is minus into minus plus 5 plus 8 is 13. We should keep the minus sign and write 13. Since we have two minus signs, the sign remains minus, the numbers will be added. Now, on the right hand side, we have minus 8 plus x. Now, we will take this minus 8 to the left hand side. That is, let us write this minus 13 as it is. Now, this minus 8 becomes plus 8 when it comes to the LHS. That is, any number which comes either to LHS or RHS from the other side, the sign changes. That is, on the right hand side, 8 has minus sign. If it comes to the left hand side, it becomes plus 8. That is, this minus 8 becomes plus 8 is equal to the leftover element or the leftover alphabet which is there is x. This minus 8 came to the left hand side, it became plus 8. The x is written. Now, we have minus 13 plus 8 minus into plus minus 13 minus 8 is 5. But the sign for the greater number is minus that is minus 5 is equal to x. We got therefore we got x is equal to minus 5. As we assumed this missing integer as x, we got x as minus 5. Let us write here. Similarly, we will see the next problem. We have minus 53 plus dash is equal to minus 53. Now, we will assume this missing integer as x. See here, I will write this minus 53 plus as it is. Now, I will assume this missing integer as x is equal to minus 53. Now, let this x be here and write the RHS value. If you see, I have minus 53 on the left hand side that is to the left of is equal to, I have minus 53 plus x. I have written only x and on the right hand side I have minus
minus 53. I have written minus 53. Now, what about this minus 53? This minus 53 goes to the right side. That is, it becomes plus 53. As I said, a number sign changes when it moves either to left hand side or right hand side. So, this minus 53 goes to the right hand side and becomes plus 53. Now, x is equal to minus into plus minus 53 minus 53 is 0. Therefore, we got x is equal to 0. Let us write 0 here. Minus 53 plus 0 is equal to minus 53 as 0 is negligible. We are getting the same value. Now let us see few more questions. Third question, we have 17 plus dash is equal to 0. Now let us assume this missing integer as x. That is 17 plus x is equal to 0. Right? 17 plus this missing integer as x is equal to 0. Now, let us write x is equal to 0. Now, I have here 17 that is positive integer plus 17. If this 17 goes to the right hand side, that is from left hand side to right hand side, the sign of the number changes. This plus 17 becomes minus 17. If it comes to the right hand side. Now as you know 0 is negligible. Let us write x is equal to minus 17. Therefore x is equal to minus 17. If you see here we assumed this missing integer as x. I got x as minus 17. Let us write. Right, if you see this, we got 17 plus of minus 17 is equal to 0. 17 plus into minus, minus 17 is equal to 0. 17 minus 17 is equal to 0. We have proved. Now, let us see fourth question. We have in a brackets 13 plus of minus 12 plus missing integer is equal to 13 plus in brackets minus 12 plus of minus 7. Now let us write this as it is and assume this missing integer as x. 13 plus of minus 12 Plus, let us assume this missing integer as x is equal to 13 plus, let us write in a brackets, minus 12 plus minus 7, close the bracket. Now, we will solve this part that is 13 plus into minus, minus 12. Plus x. I remove the brackets and solve the left hand side part. That is 13 plus into minus minus 12 plus x. Now on the right hand side we have 13 plus of minus 12 plus into minus minus 7. See, I have removed the brackets and solved it. 13 plus minus 12 plus into minus minus 7. Now, let us see. 13 minus 12 is 1. 1 plus x. 13 minus 12, 1 plus x is equal to 
13 plus into minus minus 12 minus 7. 13 plus into minus minus 12. The leftover number minus 7. Now we have 1 plus x on left hand side. And here let us solve negative numbers first. Write 13 as it is. We have minus 12 minus 7. Minus into minus plus. 12 plus 7. 19. That is minus 19. As we have two minus signs. Number gets added. And the sign remains minus. Now write 1 plus x as it is. Is equal to. It is plus here. Plus 13 minus 19. Plus into minus. Minus. 19 minus 13 is 6. But we have sign for the greater number is minus. That is minus 6. Now write x is equal to minus 6. This 1. This plus 1 becomes minus 1. If it goes to the right hand side, that is on left hand side it is plus 1. If it goes to right hand side, it becomes minus 1. Right? Now, x is equal to minus into minus plus minus 6 minus 1. That is minus 7. We got x is equal to minus 7. We assumed this missing integer as x. We got x as minus 7. Now let us solve the last bit that is fifth bit in this question. We have minus 4 in the brackets plus 15 plus of minus 3 in the brackets is equal to Minus 4 plus 15 in the brackets plus missing integer. As usual, we will assume this missing integer as x. Let us write the given problem as it is. Minus 4 plus of 15 plus of minus 3 is equal to Minus 4 plus 15 plus we assumed this missing integer as x. Right? Now let us remove the brackets and write it. Minus 4 plus 15 plus into minus. Minus we have 3. C minus 4. Plus 15 plus into minus minus 3. On the right hand side we have minus 4 plus 15 plus x. Minus 4 plus 15 plus x. Now let us solve left hand side. We have let us write plus 15 and solve the negative numbers first. We have minus 4 minus 3. Minus into minus plus 4 plus 3, 7. But the sign remains minus and we will write 7. Now let us solve the right hand side. We have minus 4 plus 15. That is plus into minus minus 15 minus 4, 11. As we have positive symbol that is plus sign to the greater number, we got positive integer and the remaining is plus x. Right? Now, 15 minus 7 is how much? Yes, 15 minus 7 is 8. Now, we have 11 plus x on the right hand side. Now, if you see, let us write 8 as it is. Let us bring this plus 11 
on the right hand side to the left hand side that is it becomes minus 11. Here we will have plus. When it comes to the left hand side the sign of the integer changes. That is it becomes minus 11 is equal to the leftover thing is x. Right? Now 8 minus 11 is minus 3. We will get minus as we have minus for the greater number. Therefore, x is equal to minus 3. We assumed this as x. We got minus 3. Let us write. You boy.